Everyone dreams about becoming an Olympian and marching in the parade of athletes. But some set ambitious goals of winning an Olympic medal. For sure, the key to these moments of a lifetime are to get these future stars involved at an early age. But of course, they need facilities to develop their skills. New York State has rebuilt all of the 1980 Olympic facilities for the 2023 World University Games to be staged in Lake Placid next year. And now, the future Olympians of tomorrow have world-class facilities to train on. And the coaches of these aspiring athletes, many of them former Olympians themselves, explain how important it is to get them involved at an early age. The exposure at this age is fantastic. Uh, I think it just sets up such an awesome opportunity. Amazing for the track to be able to provide this and just providing an opportunity for us to get this exposure for what can happen later on. But this is fabulous, uh, this program that Norda has put together. We're thrilled, you know, we, we want more and more kids and uh, this is where it all begins. You know, engaging kids at young ages is absolutely critical, especially when we focus on doing it the right way, because that really builds the foundation for the rest of their career. Um, kids at young ages are very, very susceptible to skill development, so we can develop skills really easy in young kids, but we have to do it right. And then there are the mothers who have much to do with what sport their kids get involved in. This is an incredible experience for Ryder. He came here two weeks ago to try out ski jumping. He was exposed to this at elementary school and has been excited ever since. He wanted to come back for a second round of ski jumping, so here we are. Last night he tried luge and fell in love with skeleton. So when you are in Lake Placid and at one of those amazing world-class facilities and you see some training or competition going on involving young athletes, you could be looking at a next Olympic champion.